guys, welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, welcome. My name is Naja. I am so excited to share this information with you guys. Before getting started, I do wanna ask that you guys please like this video, please share this video. And if you are not already subscribed, go ahead and click the, the uh, subscribe button and click the bell so that you are aware of every time I upload a video. So not very many people knew that I was going to Tennessee. I had not um, mentioned any of that on a previous video, but I wanted to come and to discuss exactly what my experience was while in Tennessee. It was amazing. So I was called to do or give my testimony at this amazing facility called the Blue Monarch. I will be explaining to you guys what the Blue Monarch is, giving you some behind the scenes of my journey while going there and while being there, as well as sharing with you the amazing things that this organization is a part of and what they're doing for women and children, okay? So first and foremost, I'm gonna read their mission. Their mission is to provide a long-term residential and therapeutic Christian community for women and their children to break adverse cycles and to rebuild their families. So many of these women that are housed there have just gotten out of prison, had nowhere to go, may have lost their children, um, custody of their children because of an addiction to drugs. Um, and because of this, so many women have been desperate to find help and assistance so that they don't continue on the same cycles over and over again. Most of them who continue on that cycle end up dead or end up losing their children indefinitely. And so what's so important about this and that I don't see anywhere else is how brilliantly put together this organization is. Not only is it Christian based, so they are teaching them based on the word and there is rules and regulations in regards to what goes on here. Just to let you know what their services are. They have counseling and addiction recovery, spiritual growth, parenting, sober program, I'm sorry, parenting sober program and hands-on coaching, Proverbs 22.6 children's program, life skills in healthy living, work ethics training, job training, and on-site employment without of the blue granola. Basically what that is is, the uh, founder has a business where they make granola. So what they have done is incorporated this business within the organization so that the women can be employed and have something to, uh, some skills to put on their resume so that they're able to um, build their skills before going out into the world. So with this program, it's not anything like you know, halfway house or somewhere that someone goes temporarily to seek shelter. This is a program that is available in order to completely restore, not only the mother, but in store the child, to restore the child. In a lot of situations like this, where the mother has an addiction or has gone to prison, the children end up swapping roles with their mother. They end up being the one that is um, acting like the parent okay, with the doing the responsibilities while the parent is, you know, um, dealing with these addictions and not able to properly parent them, so they're having to parent themselves. And so what they've noticed is a lot of what goes on in this, in this program, they are having to switch the roles, allow the children to now be children, okay, and teaching and guiding the parent on how to be a good parent. And I was completely blown away. I did not expect to go and to learn so much about this program and to fall completely in love with everything about what they have going on. Um, the purpose, like I said, of me going there was simply to go and to tell my testimony because she was concerned about any of the women who may have been released from the program and fallen into any dangers of new age and witchcraft because um, it's so prevalent in this time. And so I was so excited to be able to 
drive to Tennessee. I live in Atlanta. It was a three hour drive. It was a journey that just was like, it brought on so many memories from start to finish. So I just wanted to share a little bit of information about who they are before sharing the details behind it. And then what I wanna do is I want to in, include their information with hopes that so many of you will be able to donate to them because what they stand for is so amazing. When you see the behind the scenes and you see how gorgeous this land is, over 108 acres and these cottages that they have that are built and the things that the lifestyle that they're creating for these women to be able to live in peace and serenity, um, it just blew my mind. So the peace and the joy that's on this property, the Holy Spirit is so much in this place that it was a joy. It was such a joy to be in their presence, although they were excited that I was there. It was a joy to be in their presence. And they were so accommodating and it was amazing. I got to stay in my own cottage. There was a three bedroom cottage on the, on the grounds with my mother and my daughter, which you'll see in the footage. So I know I've been talking forever. So without further ado, I'm gonna show you guys my journey um, on the way to the Blue Monarch. On the road to Tennessee to go tell my testimony. So excited. This girl knows she loves animals and she's not afraid of them. She's following him around. Look at this beautiful property.
I want to share with you guys some things that they would um, if you would like to donate definitely you can donate by let me see so basically donating to them you can either give once you can give monthly you can donate items because they also need items or you can be a corporate sponsor okay so if you're interested in donating I will have the link listed below and I will also give you the address where you can, if you would like to send a check or a money order or something to that nature to send physically to them, you can send it to uh, post office box 1207 Montegle, that's M-O-N-T-E-A-G-L-E, -E, Tennessee 37356. Okay, if you would like to call them, their phone number is three, I'm sorry, 931. 924-8900. That's the office number. And the website is bluemonarch.org. Okay. You can also email info at bluemonarch.org. All this information will be in the description box. I just want to say thank you. Thank you so much to the founder, Susan Binkley, who is such an amazing soul for inviting me, for trusting me to give my testimony to the women that she has secured and protected and guided and led and i just pray for more grace and more mercy and more blessings to come upon this organization and may the lord continue to be with her 19 years and counting i am confessing and believing that this organization is going to expand across the united states in order to help more people who are struggling to get out of addiction and who need assistance. Because some of the people who are not able to get into a program like this, unfortunately, they end up overdosing and passing. So we need more of this. Right now they have a waiting list of over 200 families. And you can see why after looking at how gorgeous this property is and what it provides for the children and the parents. So thank you, Susan. And I hope to see you again one day soon. God bless.